little ponies to the adventure we go! Yippee! This is the best day ever! <laughs> Out of the way, ponies! Here come the ultimate slime slide! Uh-huh, ready, set, whoa! Sam, what did I tell you about mud? Look at you all! We need to fix this now! Oopsie! Let's roll off this mud, friends! Oh, that mud looks really stiff, but we have to clean this up! Good thing I got this mud remover! Ready to swipe the filthy mud off at once! <laughs> huh? Oh, thanks, Sam! No problem! All right, let's clean you up and do some makeover, Pinkie Pie! Wow! Oh! Can Baby Pinkie get some too? Baby Pinkie? Well, of course! If Mommy gets a makeover, Baby can get one too! Oh, look at that! It's really good at removing all the mud! Next is my Baby Pinkie's turn! Um, where is she? Mommy! <laughs> okay, okay, you can get down now! I can't! I'm stuck! Holy cannoli! Let me help you with that! <laughs> Of my hair too, Sue! Um, Sammy, slimes don't grow hair. Okay, baby Pinkie Pie, it's your turn to get all cleaned up. Hold still, this will be quick. We need you sparkling clean for your new outfit. Oh, I can't wait to see my new outfit! I was thinking lots of bright colors, just like a rainbow. And done! Whee! Thank you, Sue, I feel so sparkly! Mommy, I'm all clean now! Aw, oh, my baby! We are ready for the makeover! Okay, now on to the outfit! <clears throat> I need that paper, Sam! Uh, what paper? Stop playing around, Sammy! <laughs> no, <laughs> no! Oh well! <laughs> now bye-bye, slime! Sorry about that, Sam can be silly sometimes! Just hold still for a bit! <laughs> bit tickle, Sue! Oh, wait, <laughs> Pinkie Pie, come back! Hold me on the loose! I'll get her back, Sue! <laughs> Thanks, Sammy. Just make sure she doesn't find more mud this time, okay? Don't worry about that, Sue. Here she is. Hey, I got an idea for a cool design for you, Pinkie Pie. Really? Just give me the pencil, Susie. All right, here you go. <laughs> Just wait for it. Abracadabra, presto, changeo. <laughs> wow, it's awesome. Now it's coloring time. I'm a fashion genius of the slime world. You'll see more of me. Let's add some pizzazz to this design. Get ready to be dazzled, everyone! Hey, Susie! Check out my masterpiece! Uh, what is this mess, Sammy? Oh, my feta! I guess it is a disaster! Ah! Maybe you just need a little rainbow help! Voila! Oh, Rainbow Dash, you've saved us! I only need to add the shoes for the hoops. This outfit's ready for fitting! <laughs> Look at all this! You are gonna look so pretty, Pinkie Pie! Hey, Sue, I'm back! I heard my outfit is ready now! Oh yes, it is ready! Let me put it on you, uh-huh! And these shoes look really good too! Am I right, friends? Urgent unicorn stuff delivery for Pinkie Pie! Oh! Uh-oh! Oh, Susie! I promised this time I didn't make a mess with it! Uh, uh. Okay, Sam, I trust you! Let's see what's inside this envelope! Oh, wow! But, um, where should we put these? Oh, I knew there was something wrong with this delivery! Hmm? I think this goes over here. And another one goes over here. Uh-huh. I'm pretty sure this one is the main. See? And here is your horn, obviously. Let's not forget your crystal jewels. And the crown, of course. What else is left? Susie! Susie, look! I'm a flying slime! Have you ever seen anything like this? <laughs> Wee! Huh? Uh -uh. Wings! Uh -uh. Get over here, Sammy! No! Gotcha! Uh, my wings! I'm a grounded slime again! And the final touch! Great! Oh! Baby Pinky, it's your turn! I'm coming! Yeah! Oh, my Tibby Dabba! You surely look amazing! Really? Aren't we beautiful, baby Pinky? Oh yeah, the prettiest! Ah, oh, I feel amazing! Me too! <laughs> hey, hey, make way for others, will ya? Don't worry, Sunset, everyone's getting a makeover today. But first, let's clean up the mud. Just a little bit more and we're done. 
Oh, my baby needs a cleanup too. Hi, mommy. Right this way, baby sunset. Uh, does this mean I gotta prepare another outfit design? I'm afraid so. Isn't that what a fashion genius does? And that's you, Sammy. <gasps> okay, okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure I put it somewhere here. Where is it? Not this. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I found it. Yes! <laughs> I should better check it first. Uh -huh. Oh, it's here. It's here, Sue. What are you talking about? Ah, oh, your design. So what color should we make it? Oh, we must go bold, Susie. Vibrant green and blue and dazzling yellow and red. All right. Green and blue, you said? Whoops. Nice. Now yellow and red. Wow, what an enchanting color combination. Make me the prettiest so I can rule the world. Okay, but I don't get this world ruling thing. Why don't we get you in this gorgeous cape? The colors really fit your complexion. And the shoes. Oh, they're my favorite. These important headpieces will definitely make you look positively radiant. Especially the crown. And the jewel. Yep. So, how do you like your new look? Oh, oh no, wait. We still have the tail and pretty wings. There you go. And voila! She's ready too. You got it all wrong. Whoops, I'll fix it now. Hmm, here, there. Ah, that's better. Okay, it's all in the right place now. Oh, awesome! By the magic of light and cheer, make the horn and wing appear! Swish, swish! Wow! Oh, wait, am I a unicorn now? Sam, they are not for you. These are baby sunsets. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Here's your horn and your wing. There. Wow, mommy, mommy! I got my horn and wing! Oh, my baby, we are gonna make Equestria shine brighter than ever. <laughs> Yay! Now it's your turn, the Rainbow Dash family. Wait here, I'll be right back. Are we excited or what? <laughs> Let's do a little magic, okay? Yay! Um, <laughs> great art is coming. Susie, you have to see this design. It is my best work yet. Oh, I feel a wave of inspiration. Just give me a few seconds. More details here. A touch of flair there. Oh, it's perfection. Oh, do you like it? Oh, Sammy, I think you made it uh, a few sizes too big. It is the pencil's fault, not mine. All right, pencil. You think you're so smart, huh? You pranked me. No more chance for you. Goodbye. Whoa. Okay, Sammy, let me help you fix this. Shrinky shoe. Look, Sammy, it's the perfect size now. Great. Oh, really, Sue? Oh, that's so. It wasn't a prank after all. You're my trusty sidekick. I will never doubt you again. <laughs> Do you mind if I pick colors myself? Ah. Wow, great job. Now it's perfectly cut out and ready for you, Rainbow Dash. All right, let's get you dressed up with this gorgeous cape. And here come the rainbow shoes. Oh, you already look so majestic. The mane is gonna make you look like a superstar. There you go. How is it? Um, I don't think it's mine. It gives me itch. Oh. Oopsie, my bad. I'll get the right one. I will be back in a flash. Sue, help me. I can't find Rainbow Dash's mane. Relax, Sam. I got it right here. See? Oh, nice. Oh, my lovely mane! And your bangs. Why, thank you so much! I want to dress in a mane, too! We'll get those for you, baby Rainbow Dash. Come with me. Oh, they grow up so fast. <sighs> there they are. Well, that's it. We're ready to go. Wait! But you forgot the jewel, Sue! Well, I'll take care of it! Sammy, relax, would you? I have the horn and the jewel right here. And, of course, the crown. And the wing, too. For you, too, baby rainbow. Oh, you look so adorable and majestic. Ready to fly now. Okay, girls, give me your best smiles. Hold still and say cheese. Perfect. You two look amazing. Hey, 
Hey, I'm ready for my makeover too! That's great! Let's start with swiping the mud off your body! Friends, I love watching the mud removal myself! It's kinda soothing, you know? You're so good at this, Sue! Well, thank you, Twilight! We're almost done here! Great! It's your cue, Sammy! I have sparkles, stars, and a cap fit for royalty! Well, according to the Ancient Pony Encyclopedia, we're not supposed to wear caps! Mm, did I say cap? I must have misspoken! <laughs> I meant cape, of course! Okay, here it goes! Okay, is this what you want? Show me! Well, almost! Um, I… I'm feeling over my head! Susie, take over, please! Please! So, what now? Look, Twilight, I think this is perfect for you! Well, that is not what I have in mind! Huh? <sighs> nope! Cuckoo or Gaga? That is the question! And who's the fastest pony in Equestria? Is it Zoomy Zoom or Sparkle Dash? Okay, that's enough! I need fun on the playground! Come here, baby Twilight! I'll teach you how to have fun around here! You ready? <laughs> tickles, tickles, tickles! <laughs> I think this outfit fits perfectly, the one in the Ancient Pony Encyclopedia! Don't forget the jewels, Susie! Oh yeah, thanks, Sam! That's what I'm here for! There you go, little one! Off to mommy you go! Thank you, Sam! Oh, she's so cute! Goo goo go go! Hi, mama! Hi, sweetie! Sparkle and shine, outfit divine! <laughs> Absolutely adorable! And remember, honey, having fun is important in Pony's world! Yay! Mommy, come! Let's go to the trampoline! Okay, next up is Fluttershy! Fluttershy! Um, hello? Oh, there you are! Don't be shy, Fluttershy! You'll definitely love the makeover we've prepared for you! Okay! The mud removal won't take too long, I promise! See? All done! Detective Sam's on the case of a missing baby pony! Yoo-hoo, baby Fluttershy! We have everything ready in this locker for you, Fluttershy! Wow! I can't wait to see you in this beautiful dress! Here you go! Oh, you look pretty! Um, excuse me, has anyone seen a baby pony? <laughs> Don't tell me you just lost a baby pony again, Sam! Go find her! Now! Uh, on my way! Let's bring on some magic again! Ta-da! Oh my! Baby Fluttershy! <laughs> Boo! <laughs> oh, come here! Mommy's looking for you! Coming! Okay, jump on Uncle Sam! Whee! Let's go! I'll make sure you… <laughs> uh, what was that? That went too far! <laughs> Let's do it again, Uncle Sam! I'm sorry, but I'm gonna pass! Oh, wait! <sighs> Susie? Sam, are you okay? Just a little tired, boss! Ugh. Oh, poor thing! Well, at least we dressed up these ponies, too! They look gorgeous! Come on, Mama! Let's ride! Hop on, baby! Whee! <laughs> Finally, it's your turn, baby Rarity! Ready for some scrubbing? No, uh we only take hot baths! Okay, let's go to the bathtub then! It's a good thing we got one right here! <laughs> Whoa, bubbles! Here's the real spa! Sparkle on the double! That was refreshing! Perfect! Okay, your outfits will arrive soon! Express delivery checked! Be patient! Huh? Is it here already? Wow, they mean express like lightning fast! Hello! Express delivery for rarity! Whoa, heavy! Thanks, bro! Uh, sure thing! Careful there! <laughs> Time for the grand unveiling! <gasps> oh my goodness! They are… they are so gorgeous! Susie, you gotta see this! Quick! Outfit and accessories are here! Thanks, Sammy! No problem! Rarity is gonna love this dress! It is absolutely divine! Hey, Sue! Check out my new hair extensions! Hey, those are Rarity's manes! Oh, come on! Alright, let's whip up something for you! Bibbidi poppity boo! Huh? Oh, nothing happened, Sue! Okay, let me try! Give some space, please! There you go, baby Rarity! 
Oh, he looks so adorable and majestic. Wow, how did you do that? Cool! Thanks, we are on to the rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> this game's so fun and exciting. Hi up! <laughs> wow, you girls are so clean. Let's get you into your outfits. Yay! Um, think I'm gonna pass. I gotta finish this level in my game. Are you sure? Look what I got for you, lovely ponies. Come and get it. Hey, give me that apple. Got my apple. Uh-huh, and I got you. <laughs> Whoops, sorry. Um, I'll say you are ready for your makeover, Applejack. Whoosh! Ready for the photo shoot? Great! Smile and cheese! You look fabulous! We know! here in Hong Kong. I've had such a fantastic time. Oh, the maker phone's ringing. Excuse me. Oh, it's Toki. Ah! It's minute make time in Australia. Thanks, Toki. I'm on my way. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Looking good, sir. Looking good. But the hair needs some work, actually. Hold on to that, please. There we go. Very nice, sir. That's very Mr. Maker. But actually, it's still missing something. Oh, I know. A gorgeous glitter badge. It looks very nice, sir. In fact, it suits you. And that, my friends, is what we're going to make today by using these arty things. Let's have a look. We've got some sticky tape, some gloopy PVA glue, some glitter, an old toy, a rectangle of card, an old plastic lid, a brush. And as this can get very, very messy, we're going to make this on an old tray. And it might be a good idea to put down some old paper or some newspaper first. Now, my friends, do you think we can make this gorgeous glitter badge in just one minute? No way, Mr. Maker! Oh, really? Well, I think I can, but I will have to be very quick. Don't worry, though, I'll remind you how to do it at the end. Are you ready? Yeah! Good. Are you ready? Fantastic. Let's make it in a minute. Three, two, one! Start the clock! Right, the first thing we're going to do is get our old plastic lid and we're going to fold over the end of the rectangle of card and then stick it onto the plastic lid like this. Then that will help you hook the badge into your pocket. Now we need to get our old toy and we're going to get some gloopy glue. And now let's coat our old toy in gloopy glue like this. Now it can get really, really messy. We're going to put glue everywhere like that. And then I'm going to cover it in glitter. Here we go. Whoa, -ho -ho. look at that. And then I'll give it a little shake. Ah, yes, very nice. And now we're going to coat this plastic lid in gloopy glue as well. We'll get lots on. It's lots of fun, this one. There we go. And now we're going to sprinkle on some of this glitter as well. You can use whatever colour glitter you like, but we're using blue. There we go. You get glitter everywhere like that. And then you stick on your toy on top and you've made a gorgeous glitter bag. Yeah! Don't worry if there are any gaps. You can fill them in later. And when this dries, it'll look something like this. <laughs> And if you've got more than a minute, you could try some other ideas too. How about a glittery lizard badge? Or even a glittery bike badge? Or you could try a terrific turtle badge like this. 
<laughs> Gorgeous glitter badges made in just one minute. Why don't you try it? Here's a reminder of how to do it. Let's go back to the beginning and take another look. Fold the end of a rectangle of card and tape it to the back of a lid. Cover an old toy in gloopy glue and sprinkle on lots of glitter. Do the same with the lid. Then stick the toy on top. Your gorgeous glitter badge is finished. Why don't you try and make it in a minute? Thanks, everyone, for being part of another marvellous Minute Mate! <laughs> What's this? It's a mini makeup postcard. Let's see what we've been sent today. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Maker. I'm Catherine, and I've made a fish tank for you. First, we cut holes in a big box. We made a seahorse, some fish, and a starfish. I hope you like all my fishes, Mr. Maker. I'm Oliver, and I made a bee for you. I made stripes on it. I painted them gold and black. And then I put a happy face on it. He's got Buzz Buzz and I hope you like it. Oh, what lovely ideas. Why don't you try some of those today? <laughs> oh, oh, the maker phone's ringing. Excuse me. Oh, some mini makers are calling. Hello, I'm Vitara from Brazil and these are my friends. Can you help us make a picture? What a lovely idea! I'll see you for a high five in five, four, three, two, one. We're in Brazil. I made it! I told you I would, Mini Makers. Let's have some high five. Now, what picture would you like to make? Oh, dinosaurs! That's a great idea. Now, what do dinosaurs look like? They have teeth and big feet. Big feet like me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, everybody. Now, what noises do dinosaurs make? <laughs> Whoa! That's right. Now, apart from dinosaurs, what else should we have in our picture? A volcano. A volcano with smoke coming out of the top, maybe. I think we're ready, aren't we? Yeah! <laughs> Let's make it together. We are making the mountains. These are the dinosaurs. <laughs> And we'll need a nice green background. That's it over there. Well done, Mini Makers. We're having a great time making our big dinosaur picture. And that's just given me an idea. Oh, why don't you make something too? Try making a box pterodactyl. It's brilliant to keep as a bedroom pet. You will need a small box, paint and a brush, some card, scissors and a glue stick, stickers and a pen. First, fold a big piece of card in half and draw a wing shape starting at the folded edge like this. Draw a triangle for feet, then carefully cut these shapes out and unfold them to make wings and feet. Now, fold another piece of card in half and draw a triangle on the fold for a head. And a small rectangle for the neck, like this. Then carefully cut them out and unfold them. Next, paint the box and leave it to dry. Then, glue the box to the wings. Stick the feet to the bottom of the box. The neck to the top of the box. And glue the head onto the neck. Add stickers for eyes, nostrils, and spots on the body and wings. Your box pterodactyl is finished. 
and ready to play with. <coughs> what a great idea! Why don't you try it? But right now, let's take a look at our dinosaurs! <coughs> Done everyone! We made it together! Yay! Wow! Look at those dinosaurs! Do you think that purple one could be a paper saurus? Oh, I'm off! Wow! What an amazing arty adventure we've had! Remember, wherever you are in the world, keep making! <laughs> Oh, it's the maker phone. Oh, it's Tucky. Ah, time to go. Time to go. Oh, thanks, Tucky. I'll be home soon. Ah, oh, well, that's it for now. My making time's over, but yours is just beginning. It's time to put the marvelous maker case back in its box. <laughs> Surprise party copper! <laughs> what a super sparkly hand! Today, Scraps is getting some help from one of the mini makers. Hello, my name is Gabriana, and if you want to make glittery hands like this, well, here's how you do it. First, you pour glue PVA glue onto a paper plate. Then you put your hand in the glue. Then, after you've done that, move everything aside and so you can put it on the card. Press your hand into the paper. Wash the glue off your hand. Now you put on the glitter. Raining glitter. Now, when you've done the sprinkling on the glitter, you move your tray, old tray, like this. And you put it like this. It looks like this. And that's how you make a glittery handprint. Thanks, Gabriana. And you can make any sort of glittery print you want. That's it, Mini Makers. Last few finishing touches. And let's see some hand prints here. Let's have a look at yours, Liam. Show us your lovely handprint. I added some sparkling dots to make my handprint shiny. Well done, you did a great job. It looks very sparkly indeed. And over here, Teddy, what different colours did you use? Purple and yellow. Purple and yellow glitter. Two different colours. Good idea. And last but not least, Millie, you didn't do a handprint. What did you do? I did some finger dots and to finish it off I did I used some lovely glitter to make it colourful. That looks brilliant, Millie. And now for something completely different. Mini makers, follow me this way. <laughs> Come on everyone. <laughs> That's it. You are about to make a brilliant party picture. Have a look at the screen and see if you can guess what it is. What picture are today's mini makers making? Any ideas? <laughs> what do you think it could be? Diamond ring! That's right, it's a very sparkly diamond ring. Well done, Mini Makers. <laughs> You know what that noise means? It's time for... <laughs> so, it's over to Party Cam to find out which Mini Makers are playing today. Off you go. It's Christiana! Who's next? Let's find out. Here we go. It's Kylie! And last but not least, off you go! It's Stanley! Yay! Well done, my 
friends, you've been chosen for a very special arty challenge! <laughs> Today's game is called Utter Glitter Butter Flutter. Try saying that three times quickly. And Mini Makers, your arty challenge is to make three sparkly butterflies like this. But the difference is, you're going to use those big butterfly pieces over there to make three massive sparkly butterflies on this huge piece of paper. So, Stanley, Kylie and Christiana, do you think you can do it? Yes! Well done. I think you can do it too, but you must finish before Scraps makes this noise. <laughs> Good luck. Ready, steady, go! That's it, Mini Makers, off you go. That's it, put them all together. You've remembered the antennae. Well done, Kylie. Look at that. Stanley, well done. That's it, Mini Makers, working as a team, just like me and Scraps. That's it, it's looking really good. Hurry up, Mini Makers! Quick, quick, quick! That's it, make it look all neat. <laughs> Thank you, Scraps, and well done, Mini Makers! Yay! Well done, come on over here. Let's have a look at your fantastic picture. Wow, look at that! Three brilliant sparkly butterflies. Well done, Mini Makers. You did a great job. But now it's time to tidy up. So come on, let's tidy up our butterfly pieces. Well done. We've had a brilliant arty party today. Hello, everyone. Are you ready for an arty party? We're in the party time. It's the perfect place for a party. So let's get arty. It's the Mini Makers. And look who I've invited, the shapes and scraps! He's so excited, all the mini makers are partying too. But most importantly, we invite you! Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one, let's go! Let's get arty, everybody party! Come on, let's dance, everyone! Let's get arty, everybody party! And it's great to see you. Now, what do you think we should make our party about today? Yes, you have a think. Have you got any ideas? Come on, the Mini Makers, over here. Over you come. Now, we're going to show you some clues, see if you can guess what our party is going to be about today. Yeah. What is it? Shout out, you know the answer. Fish. And I'll give you one last clue, Mini Makers. <coughs> Have a look at this, Mini Makers. Look. What are they? <laughs> That's right, some flippers. So, Mini Makers, what's our party going to be about today? The sea! That's right. We're going to have a party all about the sea. Scraps? Scraps, where are you? <laughs> oh, there you are. You do like to be beside the seaside, don't you, Scraps? <laughs> now, go on, see if you can find some fish. Dive! <laughs> there he goes. OK, then, Mini Makers, now we are going to go down to the sea and make an arty party picture. Now, what should we use for our picture? Well done, Mini Makers, some fantastic ideas there. And in fact, you've just given me a brilliant idea. Let's get Artie at our party and make a seaside rock pool with blue water, brightly coloured sea creatures and sand. But first, we'll need some things from... The <laughs> We 
still need some cards. We also need some gloopy glue, a brush, and some crayons or chalk. A toy fish. A toy fish doodle tube. This is a sea party, but we don't need this. There's something fishy going on here. <laughs> we'll need this. Some play sand that you can find in a toy shop. <laughs> and we'll need a pen and some stickers. <laughs> All right then, Mini Makers, let's get started. Now, this can get a little bit messy, so it's a good idea to put down some old paper or some newspaper first. Now, the first thing we're going to do is bring in some card like this, and we're going to draw a rock pool shape. Thanks, JP. That's very kind. Now, this is going to be a rock pool under the sea, so what shall we put inside, you think? Yeah. Well done. Lots of lovely ideas there. I think I'll start with some seaweed. Here we are. And what colour am I using for the seaweed? Green. That's it, green. There we go. Now, what else shall we have swimming around the seaweed? Fish. Fish. Yes, let's draw a fish. There we are. So this is our fish. That's amazing. And why not add different coloured fish and any sea creatures you like? Starfish! Now, as it's a rock pool, let's do some waves. <laughs> OK, Mini Makers, now for the messy bit. We need to brush some glue all the way around the outside of our picture. I think we might be, Jacob. Lots of glue first, though. Next, we need to sprinkle some play sand over the top. Thank you very much, Nicole. What a marvellous mini-maker. Here we go. Now, we need a tray. Thank you, Jacob. Watch this. Be very carefully. Pick up your pitcher and shake off the sand into the tray. And look at that. Whoa. It's good, isn't it? We've got a rock pool with sand all the way around it. Do you like it? Yes. Yeah. And we can add some detail to our fish and our starfish with some stickers and a pen. Finished. What do you think? Yeah. Brilliant. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed that because now you're going to get your own chance to make your party pictures. But first, you need to put on your... Party apron! Yeah. Because it's time to... Start! Lots of lovely seaside art, Mini Makers. And let's have a look at Xander's picture. This is brilliant. What's in your rock pool, Xander? Xander fish. A Xander fish? Crab. A crab. And clownfish. And a clownfish. Fantastic. Well done, Xander. Now, you keep making with your picture. Because I wonder, has anyone else ever had any arty ideas to do with the sea? Let's find out. <laughs> Many years ago, there was a famous artist called Joseph Turner. One day, he decided to paint a picture of a very stormy sea, which he wanted to make very realistic. Then, 
He had an amazing idea. That's it! But first, I need something waterproof to wear. Oh, yes! Here we go! Ha-ha! Man the rigging! <laughs> Believe it or not, some people think Turner strapped himself to the mast of a ship during a storm, and all the tossing and turning gave him some brilliant ideas. What are you looking at? I'm not a sardine, you know. And with these ideas, he painted one of his most famous pictures of a very stormy sea. Oh, can someone untie me, please? I'm feeling a bit seasick. Oh, I should get a prize for this, you know. And they'd call it the Stomach Turner Prize. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, you would say that. Wow, so he painted a picture strapped to a mast. I guess that's why they call it a masterpiece. Now let's see how the mini makers are getting on. <laughs> This looks brilliant. Let's have a look at your picture. Now, what have you got in here? Well, I've got a blue fish and a purple fish. Mm. And I've got a frog and a starfish. Ah, and what are these all around here? Um, they're called sea anemones. Wow, sea anemones. That's brilliant. <laughs> Right then, Nicole, tell me about your lovely picture. Well, I like the sandcastle and I like the seahorse and the heart in it. Yes, your rock pool is a heart shape and I love it. Now, Nathan, what are you sprinkling sand onto there? A sandcastle. Well done, Nathan, and well done, Mini Makers. You have made some super <laughs> seaside pictures. Can you hear that noise? It, it sounds like someone's asleep at our party. Who is it, everyone? It's the Shapes! That's right, my friends. It's the Shapes, and I think we should wake them up. So after three, shout, wake up as loud as you can. One, two, three. Wake, wake up! up! Well done, Square. It's time to get back on the shelf. to make a paper plate stingray like this. All you need to do is colour in a paper plate with a wax crayon. Then colour in a thin triangle of card as well. Bend the plate with both hands like this. 
and fold the triangle in half. Now stick it to the paper plate to make a tail. Add stickers for eyes. And your paper plate stingray is finished and ready to play with. What a brilliant idea, Scraps! You can make any sea creature you like. Christopher, tell us about what you've made there, my friend. Well, I've made a colourful clam that can open up. Oh, that's great. Well done, Christopher. And Miriam, what have you made here? Show I us. I made a starfish. It has yellow and orange colours. Well done, Miriam. And then over here, last but not least, Joshua, what have we got here? A spotty stingray. A spotty stingray, just like my waistcoat. Well done, Joshua, and well done, Mini Makers. And now for something completely different. Jump up and follow me. Follow me, everyone, this way. Yeah. Mini Makers, you are about to make a brilliant party picture. Now, have a look at the screen and see if you can guess what it's going to be. What picture are today's Mini Makers making? Any ideas yet? <laughs> what do you think it could be? It's a turtle! That's right, it's a turtle! Well done, Mini Makers! <laughs> you know what that noise means? It's time for... Party party game. Game. Yeah. 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 So it's over to party cam to find out which mini makers are playing today. <laughs> it's Nicole. Yeah. Yay. Who's next? <laughs> it's Iona. Yeah. Yay. Off you go, party cam. Who's it going to be? It's James! Yeah! Last one! Yeah! It's Xander! Yeah! Well done, my friends. You've been chosen for a very special arty challenge. <laughs> Today's game is called Splish, Splash, Splosh. And your arty challenge is to float the good ship maker. But at the moment, there isn't a sea for it to float on. So you need to use your brushes and your paint to create a beautiful sea for this boat to float on. Now, it can get very, very messy. So that's why you're wearing your arty suits and we've put down lots of old paper first. Now, Nicole, James, Iona and Xander, do you think you can do it? Yeah! You must be very quick and you must finish before Scraps makes this noise. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Go! Load up those brushes. That's it. It looks nice if you mix up some of the colours. It looks brilliant. Oh, that looks good. Look at the white mixing in with the blue. <laughs> oh, quick, Scraps is getting ready. We better get the boat on. Right, brushes down, everyone. Come round here. Here we go. Let's put it down. Very nice. Just in time. You did it, Mini Makers. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Look at that fantastic picture. A boat on a super sea. Well done, everyone. But now it's time to tidy up, and I'll help you, Mini Makers. What a fantastic arty party we've had today. Come on, everyone. Right, let's pick this boat up first of all. We've had a super seaside party, making sandy rock pools and paper plate creatures. We've learnt about Joseph Turner's stormy paintings, and we've splished, splashed, and sploshed afloat the good ship maker. We win arty at our arty party. Are you ready? 
your fun just began! Yes, our party's over, but your arty fun is just beginning. It's time to put the party pad back in its box. See you soon, everyone! Yeah. Bye! Hello, everyone! Are you ready for an arty party? We're in the party pad! It's the perfect place for a party. So, let's get arty! It's the Mini Makers! Hello, Mini Makers! Now, my friends, are you feeling arty? Yeah! Then let's party! Here we go! We're going to have a party, and look who I've invited the shakes and scraps! He's so excited, all the Mini Makers are partying too. But most importantly, we invite you! Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one, let's go! Let's get arty, everybody party. Let's get arty, everybody party! Are you ready? It's great to see you, my friend. Now, what shall we make our party about today? Hmm, you ever think about it? Have you got any ideas? Over you come, Mini Makers. Come on, my friends. That's it. Have a look at the screen. Now, we're going to show you some clues. See if you can guess what our party is going to be about today. What is it? Oh, and what's it covered with? Yes. Oh, what's that? And what is it? It's very... And sparkly, isn't it? And look at this. What's all that? And what is glitter? And I'll give you one last clue, Mini Makers. Watch. That's right, Mini Makers. Our party today is going to be all... Sparkly! Wow! Scraps, is that you? <laughs> I could hardly see you with that sparkly jacket. Yeah, I wish I had sparkles on my jacket. <laughs> yeah! All right, then, let's think sparkly thoughts and make an arty party picture. What should we use today, Mini Makers? Hey, Pa! Hey, Glitter! What should we make a picture of? Well done, Mini Makers. Some great ideas there. And in fact, that's just given me a brilliant idea. Let's get arty at our party and make an arty, sparkly spider's web, complete with its own funny, furry spider in it. But first, we'll need some things from... The That's right! Need some gloopy glue and some glitter. Some sticky tape, some pipe cleaners, and some fun fur. A fluffy slipper. A fluffy slipper? Doodle tube, we need glitter, not a slipper. <sighs> And we'll need some card and some stickers. <laughs> OK, Mini Makers, let's get started. We're going to bring in some nice paper or card and we're going to cover it in gloopy glue. Now, it's a good idea to do this on a tray or some old paper. So let's get some gloopy glue. Here we go. Lots of squiggles everywhere. Now, this can get a little bit messy. So it's a good idea to put on some old clothes or an apron. There we go. We've got a nice squiggly, swirly spider's web. And now we need to make it a sparkly spider's web. So we're going to cover it in... Glitter! That's right, glitter. Here we go. It's like a 
like the glitteriest thing I've ever seen in my whole entire life. I love sparkles. Me too, my friend. Lots and lots of glitter, and now we need to shake it off. So we're going to do that onto a tray. So we can use the glitter later if we want to. We're going to pick it up very carefully and give it a shake. What's it going to be? There we go, you're right, a sparkly spider's web. Look at that, Mini Makers. And now we need to make a spider to go in the web. So let's take some fun fur, and I'm going to take these four pipe cleaners. OK, Millie, put the sticky tape down. That's it. There we go, it's looking good already. And now we need to add some stickers for eyes. There we are, and we've got a very fluffy spider. So let's add him to our sparkly web. There you go, my friends. Do you like our picture? Yeah! And now you're going to make your own arty party pictures, but first you need to put on your... Arty apron! <laughs> because it's time to... Very nice, Mini Makers. So, Fuad, let's have a look at your sparkly picture. Now, what have you used here? You've used gloopy glue, and then what have you shaken on top? Blue and, and yellow glitter. Not one, but two different colours of glitter. Well done, Fuad. You keep going, my friend, and make your spider. I wonder, has anyone else ever had any sparkly, arty ideas? Let's find out. Many years ago, there was a tribe of people called the Maya. They built cities filled with beautiful buildings and palaces. Oh dear, what am I going to do? The king will be so angry if I don't follow his orders. I want my palace to sparkle in the sun. But there was one big problem. Sparkly paint had not been invented. Then. All of a sudden, the builder had a brilliant idea. Eureka! Mica! He discovered that if a glittery rock called mica was crushed into tiny pieces, it could be mixed with a type of paint and brushed onto the front of the buildings to make them sparkle in the sun. So, when the sun shone on the mica, it sparkled in the sun. <laughs> Africa mica! The king should be very happy. <laughs> I'm very happy. Everyone will want a sparkly palace just like mine. I like her, the mica. Well, fantastic. What a sparkling success. Now let's see how the Mini Makers are getting on. <laughs> wow, Kylie, what have you made here? Fly in a tree. A fly in a tree, so we've got a fluffy fly with spotty wings. And what's the fly sitting on here? Branches. Very sparkly branches. Brilliant. And Mohammed, tell me what have you made here? He's called a fly spider on the world's wiggliest spider web. <gasps> the world's wiggliest spider web. <laughs> Where have you put your little spider? I put it right in the middle of the giant crazy web. Brilliant. And down here we've got a lovely little caterpillar. And what's that at the top? A tiny little butterfly wing so it can fly away and be free. A little butterfly. Beautiful. Christiana, this is very sparkly. What's in your picture? 
It's an alien spider with lots of eyes and colourful legs. And what's this next to it? It's an ant that has been stuck to the web. Oh, no! Poor old Mr Ant! Oh, dear. It's just a... What's that noise, everyone? Can you hear that? It, it sounds like someone's asleep at our party. Who is it, everyone? <laughs> That's right, it's the shapes. I think we should wake them up. So after three, ready? One, two, three. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! <laughs> <laughs> Let's all dance with the shapes! I am a circle. Spin around, spin around in a circle on the ground. I am a triangle. Clap your hands in the air, triangles everywhere. I am a square. Everybody draw a square, draw it here, draw it there. Everybody draw a square. I am a rectangle. Bounce everybody! Like you just don't care. Bounce, bounce, What's it going to be? Wait and we will see a shape for you and me. I am a triangle. Yay! What is triangle making today? Can you guess? That's right, it's a sparkly wand. That was fantastic, Triangle. It's time to get back on the shelf. Yay! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Hello, everyone. Are you ready for an arty party? We're in the party pack. It's the perfect place for a party. So, let's get arty! It's the Mini Makers! OK, my friends, are you feeling arty? Yeah! Then let's party! We're gonna have a party and look who I've invited. The shakes and scraps! So excited, all the mini makers are partying too. But most importantly, we invite you. Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Let's get party, everybody party. Let's get party, everybody party. Are you ready? Hello, Scraps. It's great to see you, my friend. Now, what should our party be about today? Um... Ah. No, not yet, Scraps. Let's see if the Mini Makers have got any ideas. Ah. Over you come, Mini Makers. <laughs> That's it, my friends. Well done. Now, have a look at the screen. We're going to show you some clues. See if you can guess what our party's going to be about today. And what shape is it? Triangle! And I'll give you one last clue, Mini Makers. Look, it's my tasty lunch here. Two sandwiches. And what shape are they? Triangle! That's right, they are terrific triangles because today our party's all about triangles! Yay! Hello, Scraps. <laughs> and yes, it's time <laughs> to bring out the bunting. <laughs> And, of course, bunting mm. is made mm. from lots of colourful triangles. Looks mm. like you're working up an appetite. Mm. So, here, have a sandwich, my friend. Mm. Yay! 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 So, my friends, let's make an amazing arty party picture. What shall we use today? Paper and card. Bright colours. Glue. 
pens. Well done, Mini Makers. Some great ideas there. And in fact, that's just given me a brilliant idea. Let's get Artie at our party and make a picture full of clucks and tweets in a funny farmyard with triangle-shaped birds. But first, we'll need some things from... The Tiddle Tube! That's right! <laughs> we'll need some coloured paper and card. Some stickers. A triangle-shaped piece of pie. Ooh, don't mind if I do, Doodle Chew, but wait a minute. There's art to start. I'll eat this later. And we'll need some glue and a pen. OK, Mini Makers, let's get started by making a background for our picture. Now, you can use any colours of paper or card you like, but today I'm going to use light blue for the sky. And I'm also going to use some other colours of paper for the ground and the rolling hills. Let's start with this nice green. I'm going to very carefully tear a nice wiggly hill shape. Let's try another colour now. You can make as many strips of paper as you want. And now, my friends, we need to add some glue. Brilliant. OK, let's stick it on. Then stick down the rest of your paper strips like this. Now, remember, Mini Makers, this is a triangle party. So what should we use next? Triangles! Yes, let's use some triangles. Going to use this pink one first. It's going to be a very brightly coloured bird. And now let's have another colour. And last but not least, a nice bright yellow triangle. And what else should we give our birds? Beak. Good idea, Charles. Beaks! And for this, let's use smaller triangles. Next, we can add stickers for eyes. We can even add colourful stickers to make a spotty bird. And now we can use a pen to add some finishing touches. And it's done. Do you like that picture, Mini Makers? Yeah! Well, I'm glad you like it because now it's your turn to make your own arty party picture. But first, you've got to put on your. Party apron! <laughs> it's time to. Start the art! Kimberly has made a very colourful start to her picture. What have you made with triangles? I made a big bird with its little baby. Ah, big mummy bird and a little baby bird. And it's a bright sunny day. We've got a sun in the corner here and a fluffy cloud. And what did you use for the fluffy cloud? I used white circles. Well, Kimberly, you have done a great job. High five. And it makes me wonder. Has anyone else ever had any arty ideas about triangles? Let's find out. Many, many years ago, when artists painted their pictures, they looked very flat. Then, about 500 years ago, someone discovered a way of making the pictures look less flat. This is called perspective. That's it! All done! It jumps off the page! All of a sudden, artists discovered that their paintings could be made to look more real by making sure that any lines in their pictures all finished up at a single spot. This spot is called the vanishing point, 
And if you look at the shapes made by the lines that head towards the vanishing point, you can see lots and lots of triangles. Who would have thought that there are secret triangles hidden in so many famous paintings? Wow, it's so realistic. I could almost be there. Wait a minute. I can be. Oh, ah, I'm here. Hello, Mother. <laughs> it's amazing what you can do with triangles. Now let's see how the Mini Makers are getting on. <laughs> Dave, it looks like some people here are going bird watching. Who's this? Me and you. <laughs> it's me and Dave. There's Dave and there's me because of my spiky hair. And what sort of birds are we watching here? Woodpeckers. Brilliant. We've got a red woodpecker and some yellow triangle-shaped birds. Brooke has made a really colourful picture here. What did you make with triangles? I made some fish. Some fish at the bottom of the sea. And right at the bottom of the sea, what are these things? They're little pebbles. And how did you make those? I used some stickers. And some extra detail with a pen. <laughs> this is a great picture of Egypt made by Sam. We've got triangle-shaped birds. We've got triangles for the pyramids. And what's this, Sam? A camel. A camel. And what triangles did you use to make the camel? I used two big triangles for the humps, one little triangle for the tail, and one little triangle for the neck. Well done, Sam, and well done, Mini Makers. I can hear snoring, everyone. It sounds like someone's asleep at our party. Who is it? That's right, and I think we should wake them up. So after three mini makers, ready? One, two, three. Wake up! <laughs> How many differences can you spot? One, two, three, four. That's right, there are four differences. That was fantastic, Triangle. It's time to get back on the shelf. Yay! 